It's 10.33 p.m. and I just got home not too long ago. My best friend and I went to a documentary premiere and it was pretty cool. So I kind of just want to talk to you guys about that. I don't know, just watching it was a life-changing experience. I mean, not like a huge thing that, like I made it sound, but just... It's just, it was just a good thing that happened. There's been two events this week that have been really life-changing for me, and I, I love that it's happening now because there's so much going on. I'm talking a little because I'm really tired and I want to go to sleep, but I wanted to make this before it leaves my brain. I have the, the inspiration, and I also have a pimple. It's horrible. I don't even want to turn that way. I don't want to scare you guys. Anyway, so, real quick, his name is, I don't know, I'll put it right here, he's a human rights activist, and his documentary was amazing. He's a gay man, and he was talking about how he had to flee, so he was exiled from his country for 24 years, and after, he went back, and he is now an activist for human rights. It was just mind-blowing, like, he was there, and so was the director of the actual documentary, and she lived it through with him. Like, but being there just made me think about what I do, because they were talking to the audience, and he said that everybody in the audience that was just there today is making a difference even if it's a small difference and I sit back and I think about it and it's so true if every single person in that room goes and talks about this film or shares it or tells people about it and then the next person could tell the next person to the next then this is, this is how things spread by word of mouth by sharing and that's what I urge you guys to do all the time is share and these last couple of weeks I have been very sad because I just feel like maybe I'm not doing enough for people or maybe I'm not doing enough to help out there and so I feel like I'm just getting nowhere with so much and it, it makes me sad because I love doing videos to help you guys and I love being that person that somebody might need and so going here tonight really helped me with that and I don't know I just I've I've been getting really sad because I feel like I'm I'm in the same spot, and of course I don't want to be in the same spot, I want to help, I want to advance, I want to make things better for so many of you, but I feel like I'm, I might be letting some of you down, and what Mio said, and how he explained things, and how you know me, because a lot of you, some of you, write to me and you guys tell me about how you're gay or you're a lesbian or whatever you identify as but your country doesn't accept it what well, he found a way and he's fought and he's gone back and he's helped and he's done all these things and that's why i say you should watch this documentary because it's not just about lgbt it's about human rights equally all around you know it makes me sad that that a lot of people don't care about sharing things like that or they don't take the time to share stories or movies or documentaries or things they see and that's something that you should do if you really care about the community and you care about helping other people maybe you don't that's fine but that's how we need to become a stronger community and and by community i don't just mean the lgbt i just mean all together the human race we all just need to push forward and the director actually said something that stuck with me and she said no matter how tall the mountain walk on and that was what hit home to me and I was like, that's crazy, it's true. No matter the obstacle, look at Mio. He's been through so much. He lost the love of his life. He lost someone so important to him who had to be away from his family for so long. But look at him, he's going strong and he's taking an international documentary tour and that's amazing. And you guys can accomplish the same things, maybe not film, maybe it's something that you have a passion for, but go out and do it, and I feel like I'm not getting through to people, and I would really like to, because I honestly do these things, because I feel like, I feel so happy when I help some of you, I feel so happy when you guys tell me that you watch my videos, because you're having a bad day, and you know, you need something to make you feel better, and maybe I'm not putting out stuff that people want to see or hear anymore. I used to have people watching me, and, and tweeting at me, and sending me messages and I, I do get the feedback of helping on tumblr and i'm barely able to get back into that now because i had a bunch of work to do and i finally am finishing up and i'm finally having more time for myself to do all that but i mean i do get messages all the time on tumblr and stuff but for some reason i just felt like in my heart that i wasn't doing right but then i think about it and i think about what the director said today that if you feel like you're not doing anything to help just share things because everything happens through word of mouth she said that we we have to help each other he said we have to be strong voices for people 
who are voiceless and that's true and that's what I try to do with YouTube and with you guys and that's why I, I urge you guys to share and like I said it doesn't have to be my stuff I, I'd like it if you'd share my stuff and I get so happy when you guys share my stuff because that just means that I shared my thoughts with you or my help or my advice with you and you share it with another person and another person will share it to the other person and now it's reached eyes to at least maybe four or five people and you're helping people along the way and who wouldn't want to do that helping people is amazing it's such a great feeling and granted I never thought I'd be sitting here doing this kind of stuff but life has just taught me it's all about giving back and you know if you don't want to give back cool but I think I just ramble too much but I just basically wanted to say that I've been sad about it but going today make me feel a lot better even if I just reach a couple thousand of you even if I reach a hundred of you at least one person that I can help is enough and that's what keeps me going so I was very inspired today very motivated I gained motivation that I was starting to lack it was a good experience and and I just want to say thank you again to every single one of you that have stuck by my side regardless of what has ever gone on or happened or will happen and um, and thank you to those who will continue to stick by my side thank you to everybody who writes to me and says hey you know I've been watching you for four years or I've been watching you since 2013 you guys should really honestly know that you know it does help to share things if you find an article that you think people should read or hear go and share it with the world share it with people that you think could benefit from it you never know what's going to happen or who's going to say something or what you could say to someone to change their lives or to make a difference in their lives and that's something that we should all strive to do and if it's something so simple you don't have to move mountains for people if that's not your thing you can make a difference by just sharing something and spreading the word about something that you're passionate about or that you liked or that you know will be helpful to more people and i think about it like this world is so cruel already why wouldn't anybody want to help someone you know and if you can help by a push of a button you can help by a tweet or retweet or reblog it goes miles i'm just i'm passionate about helping especially since i've been through a lot of things and i've been through it and i just like to do that so i'm gonna go to bed now and i hope that you all are having a great week or weekend and yeah just i don't know what else to say i feel like i missed out on a lot of things that i wanted to say i had so much to say and did way here and now i just honestly cannot even remember <laughs> but uh, it was just um, but yeah, so, I don't know, okay, well, good night for me, and good night, good morning, good evening, good afternoon for you, or good night, did I say good night, or probably say good night, don't forget to follow me on my social medias, please, and thank you, they're all listed on the screen or down below, you already know, and, um, hopefully that you continue to just stick with me in this journey, thank you for sticking around and listening to what I had to say, and... I appreciate you guys, I love you guys, and I will see you guys in the next video. <laughs>